Now when we are done with the living room we can create and animate the robot. We will use the CC0 human base mesh from blendsweb.com. My recommendation is to reduce the mesh density with the remesh modifier to make it easier for you to work. To make seams select an edge bevel and extrude along normals. To make holes subdivide one face several times and make a circle with the loop tool. Create metal parts on the shoulders and legs with the shrink wrap, bevel and solidify modifier. Make the holes on the legs and hands with the boolean modifier. It is good to have gribbles prepared in advice for things like this. I use some that I made earlier. You can find similar online or on my Patreon or you can model them. Now we can create a material for the robe. Add scratches with the help of texture from mbscg.com and color them. For the base color you can choose a yellowish color or plastic texture. For roughness concrete texture. You can also add a logo, graffiti or similar to the base color. Just multiply with the texture of the plastic and fix the UV. You can also increase the visibility of scratches by painting them black. Just use the same scratch texture as a vector. The easiest way to animate the robot is through Mixam. Export robot as FBX or OBJ and upload to Mixam. Select the animation and return the file to Blender. Now we can place the robot on the seat and set the camera. To put the robot more in focus you can use the door as vignetting object. Emission objects in the background can give you a nice bokeh effect. A little color correction and a couple of effects in After Effects and we are done. If this video is too fast for you in the description you can find a step by step 4 hour and 30 minutes long tutorial with much more details plus Apple Macintosh tutorial and other tutorials. Please subscribe.